Okay, I'm making this video to help others who might possibly be going through this situation. And the situation I'm talking about is cyberbullying. Cyberbullying is the term they came up with uh, for children. But actually, if you're an adult, it's cyber harassment. And um, basically, it is against the law. It's against the law. You can, if you're really getting a serious problem from it, you can actually file ch charges against the individual, and that's the term you use. You, um, <coughs> you can subpoena that person's uh, uh, profile on a website, and, uh, and YouTube, my face, whoever, where you ever get, you getting it from, you can subpoena for their IP address, how they accessing the internet, and yes, you can file a, charge against the individual who engages in the in the activity of cyberbullying. It's against the law. It's one of few laws that's in place. And they really, you know, really have it uh the focus is on children. But if you read further into it you will find out that uh, uh it applies to adults too. And um just to let you know a little bit about myself, you know I'm a serious person. I'm serious. I'm, I'm oh so serious all the time. Actually, too much for my too much stuff for my own good. So I kind of started this YouTube stuff for fun to de-stress. I had to deal with fibromyalgia. That's chronic pain and fatigue all the time. Every video you have ever seen, I'm in pain. I'm in pain right now, 24/7, 365 days. So I don't I don't come to the internet for stress. I want to de-stress. That's what I do. You know, I work hard on the computer because I, I still freelance and, and do a lot of uh, freelance work for people, uh, fixing, helping them install, upgrade, repair their computer. It could, considering that I'm retired, I still be helping people in that area. Um, I'm about the only one I know when I go to family get-togethers, you know, that's when I end up working because, you know, the average person, and my family can't afford to uh, take their system to Best Buy and, 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 and hope they fix the problem, you know, and they like me to do it because they, they can trust me. They know they go to a place like Best Buy, they can jack them up all kinds of ways and prices and say all that tech lingo go over their head, you know, so they'll trust me. So trust them. So me, that's, you know, that's my life. I do it. I'm, uh, computers is what I do. So... Like I said, you know, I be on this thing for fun. Um, you know, I, I'm going to tell my full YouTube story, and, and uh, part of the story is when I joined a twerk site, and I experienced the worst cyberbullying I have ever come to experience in my life. It, it actually has scarred me because I keep, you know, I keep going back to it and telling other people about it and they don't really truly understand the whole nature of it, why, you know, I took it so hard. It, it's deep. It's deep, and I am going to tell that whole story. But for now, I'm focusing on this individual, uh, Commando 713, who just, I mean, wow, 32 years old, and you on the Internet calling women bitches all over the place. You know, it's not like he's talking to his buddy, and, you know, they loosely using the term bitches. He is directing that to them in a derogatory manner, in a hateful manner. So it's, uh, that's harassment. Um, you know, he, he referred to all type of shit, like my, um, my, uh, my VJJ, you know. How you get to see all that? You can make all them t uh, type of conclusions about that from what you see in the video, you know? I got my own website, and trust and believe, the ones who have seen, baby, they want to put the face all up in it. You know, ain't no shame. Ain't no shame. No shame in my game, okay? None. And um, like I said, I, I, I have my own website, and by the way, that's, a shout out straight straight up plug to me big sexy dot com b i double g s c triple x dot com that's my website 
I'm, I, I'm, I'm a webmaster. And I say I'm a, wedding, a budding webmaster because I don't, uh, I don't know everything yet. It took me a year to build it, work on it, blood, sweat, and tears to get it to where it's at. I got about 900 members on there now. And they are all backgrounds, all ages. You know, this nigga was talking about, uh, you know, what, who wouldn't want to do what to me. I got young'uns, 18-year-olds. I got old'uns, old heads, couples. I got couples on there want to get busy with me, okay? Stop playing. And I say I'm a buddy webmaster because I learned the hard way why they call it webmaster. You got to master a lot of shit. I mean, real talk, a master a lot of shit. It's not for the kids. That's why I really don't like how Ning and, and Facebook and all this make it so accessible, accessible to kids. Uh, you shouldn't be able to get a website or control of a website unless you have some level of maturity. And so just like they don't let nobody vote before a certain time or drive before a certain time or even have sex before a certain time, uh, that's how I feel, real strong. Kids should not be on here before a certain time. You know, and if they are, they should be monitored. I'm not telling anybody that kids shouldn't be able to express themselves, that it should be on a website or a situation where it's monitored closely, just like you wouldn't send your kid out to any type of school, at the school that don't have no adults there to supervise and monitor that shit. No, you, you're not going to do that. But that's the way it is on the, on the Internet. Wild civilization. And a youngin' on this other twerk site, uh, shout out to Ray DMV, ain't never treated me disrespectful. And he put them young niggas in check, you know, when they come, when they come stupid with the, the females on there twerking. You know, he running his stuff right. Uh, uh, he out in the uh, D.C. area, and they, they do the go-go stuff. So this is a plug out to him. If you respect the twerking, you like twerking, they on there. Ray D, uh, DMV Clappers, DMV C-L-A-P-P-A-S dot net. Um, you know, I respect him because of how he running his site, you know. But the other twerk site, I, oh, my God. Y'all just don't know how the story goes. Um, but anyway, it's not for kids. Is not for kids. Web mastering is not for the kiddies. They not there yet. That's a big responsibility to be handling people and their personal content being posted on on your site, and you should not be um, having that unless you sign a contract and be held accountable. Be able to be held accountable. It's not for the kids. Uh, a youngin gave me a compliment on. Uh, DMV clappers say yes you show them you show these youngins what to do I said no nah, I need to show the old heads and the youngins the old heads don't get with the technology I see a lot of places all the time because the average person my age just ain't with the technology yet you know they ain't getting on the computer you see them at home they um you know, something go wrong with the TV, VCR, or uh, uh, DVD. They hand the remote control over to Bebe, to little Bon Quee Quee. He assists this Bon Quee Quee. You know, the kids knowing how to do the shit uh, right off the, because they're not scared to venture into technology. But I still have trouble getting, to this day, getting people my age um, with this technology. That's part of the reason why I'm still I'm shouting out one sexy Tina one her channel go check her out she keeping it real and we need a presence like that C C Kane that's another one I don't, I don't know if I'm saying that right but uh, anyway yeah um, she doing her thing we need to see that we need to see old heads here on the internet. Because we ain't uh, ready to be thrown out to the pasture just yet, you know. We ain't ready for the nursing home just yet. And there's so much disrespect 
with these young ones about, you know, the way they relate to older people. You know, I'm 49 years old and I still, I won't talk back to my mother. I know I could. But I won't. Because I, I learned respect. It's old people that say all kinds of wild stuff, but out of respect, I don't say nothing to them. I don't say nothing back to them. Out of respect. You, they deserve respect just because they made it that long. You know, y'all young, young ones, me, thinking you all this and all that, you better hope you get my age. I've been, I, I already been where you trying to get. I already been where you trying to go, okay? So stop playing. Anyway, that's my rant for now, and what's following is going to be the screenshots on exactly what you need to do if you are a victim of cyberbullying. And in the case of adults, it's cyber harassment. That's the actual term in the law that you use if you need help in that direction. And I uh, provided a link, <coughs> excuse me, I provided a link to make it completely simple. You won't have to dig through the forms and read all that stuff that's in there. You can just click right on that and report the idiot, okay, whoever messing with you. I put the, the link in the description so you can go right to it, skip, cut to the chase. Anyway, this big girl about to get her grubber dubs on. I'm proud of being fat and I'm proud of being old. And how about they just Open up a hibachi grill, all you can eat. Oh, yeah, it's about to go down. And I'm going to uh, capture that on video, too, and bring it on back. Big girl about to get it on. Peace. Okay, this is my video documentation of harassment. Um, I have uh, already officially flagged this video because it actually was posted without my permission. I didn't really have a problem with it till I picked up an internet troll here named Commando713. Really don't care if people dislike my video or have something negative to say. You know, you Everybody entitled to their opinion. I don't trip on that. What I trip out on is the individual that keep coming back and keep coming back. And it's all negative. And then dragging other people into it. That's harassment. That's harassment. I don't want that. And um, I'm um, uh, attempting to do something about it by making this video documentation. Because, um, see... Dislikes don't stop you from getting your change on with YouTube. ISIS 361 is a perfect example. That's the only, only uh, YouTuber I've seen that get more dislikes than likes. Um, People entitled. And people got all types of hate. And most of that, I'm sure the dislikes is hating on her just being fat, which is fucked up. It's a lot of fatism, hateism, and in my case, ageism. You know, individuals feel superior and think they can tell me what, you know, what to do or define me, you know. Who, who said that fun is the exclusive domain of the young and the dumb? But here's an old nigga. This is an old individual. Excuse my language. I'm trying to keep it clean. But um, I had so many other words I could say to him, but I don't. I didn't. I didn't say anything negative to him referring to any of his body features or whatever. You And he in a blank profile pic. Who knows what he had, you know. And, but he came to all, drew all kinds of conclusions from what he seen. Or, or I should say what he didn't see, you know. Because the negativity was on an area you can't even see, you know. Anyway, uh, the point and purpose of this video is to document the time and date, which is November 11, 2011, to say that this is a wrap on him because I couldn't stop him. I asked the individual who reposted this video to remove it. I haven't heard back from him, so I played my own video. Ain't that something? 
the point in which you have to flag your own visual in, in uh, video. This is my first time. Um, I was, you know, I wasn't mad at the person who reposted my video because, damn, look, 6,500 views, only three dislikes. It's only a few hateful com comments, about a handful. You can count on one hand. Only this individual kept coming back. Commando 713. In all caps, he all hyped up and pumped up, steadily coming back with stuff. You know, I ain't got time for that. I ain't got time for that. Actually, I touched down on the video because I know how it works in YouTube. If you make a comment, it brings views. It helps bring views. So I was helping Big Matt oh man out. And sure enough, when I touch down, then my little uh, thumbnail shows up in the videos. It helps you get more views, no question, no doubt about it. But I'm not going to tolerate this individual behavior, so I have flagged my own video officially. And this is also to document the fact that this Commando 713 is the internet, by the very definition, internet troll of the worst kind by him being 32 years old. Okay, this video is being made because I'm sure that there are other people out there that are having to deal with um, hateful comments and harassing. And um, this is the point and purpose of this part of my video. This individual, Commando 713, challenged me and um, uh, said all kinds of vulgar and disrespectful things to me. And no matter how many comments I wrote back, that wasn't directed towards him and his physical features or anything. I tried to bring it back around to some positive, but he was unrelenting. <clears throat> and which this morning I was just fed up. And I'm not going to tolerate it. I don't play. I don't play. I'm not a kid and I don't play. I didn't play when I was a kid. I came up hard. When I was a kid, I didn't play. So here I go. This is what I got for you. Since you chimed me and said, uh, I'll make a series for you. Here's how the series go. This is uh, YouTube's video for children. But it actually applies Playing and staying to safe online. The internet can be a lot like real life. It's fun to hang out, chat with your friends, share videos and photos, and maybe meet new people. Just as in real life, you should keep in mind a few simple guidelines to keep yourself safe. Part 1. Personal is personal. Keep your private stuff private. Don't post personal information like your name, school. Anyway, it goes on and on to say, you know, hurtful comments, comments, negative comments are hurtful, bottom line. This is intended for children, but don't think negative comments don't hurt adults. This does apply. Matter of fact, when I went to the forum, I um, came across... Uh, Individuals who are subjected to a harassing type of comments that are gay. You know, a whole bunch of people feel entitled to, to hate on gay folks, you know. And fatism is one. Ageism is one. That's what I became a subject of. Ageism. It was a tax on my personal being, an uh, image of my myself in a video that someone actually posted without my permission, actually. And um, I could have been, you know. Could have been mean about that, but I didn't. You know, I was helping his channel, basically. But this, I picked up a troll in the process, and his name is Commando Seven Thirteen. So this is what I got for you, Commando Seven Thirteen. This how our, um, this is how our movie, a series, gonna end. And I'm going through the steps and procedures for the sake and purposes of other people who are going through this. But basically, you don't see the little uh, link to the help and uh, safety tool to weigh down in the in the text. But when you get there, you do have an opportunity to uh, report people like that. Because I tried, I blocked him. He couldn't come back to me. But he kept coming back to the video. And he ain't going to stop. He's right back on there this morning with some more stuff. So he's getting reported, and it's according to this is the one that uh, fits the description, harassment, and it's myself. Then the uh, you get another option, uh, uh, 
what well, both of these apply, but out of the one for this individual, um, yeah, user has stolen my video, reposted, but I'm not gonna hate on him. Man. I took it as a compliment. The user that's a, a problem is guilty of making rude comments to me over and over again. So yes, that is a violation of YouTube guidelines in terms of uh, community service. And so right here, this is where I'm posting his uh, name, and he's uh, and the word applies. He's making rude comments to me. I didn't say nothing threatening to him or harassing towards him. Not one thing. I always try to keep it positive. I'm always like that. I keep it like that, real, 100%, always. I'm pause the video here. So I can obtain the other information they're going to need because they're going to ask you for the video, uh, URL, a link, and the comments. So, Okay, so now I'm back and I got the information I need. Okay, um, and what uh, applies in my situation is video comments. Okay, and I have to put in the video URL. So that they can find the video. Okay, then you're gonna click find video, and then you know, yeah, YouTube ain't about harassing comments. They did it, they sell all these comments lined up right perfectly. So, yes, they'll be able to examine for themselves as to whether or not these are harassing comments. Okay, and yes, I'm picking all of them. I think all of them were negative and fucked up, basically. Really, you know, it was not necessary. You know, just not necessary. It just was not necessary. I kept coming back in terms of trying to turn it around to positive, and he still kept bringing it back to childy, cutie stuff. So here I go. Um, I went to continue. Yes, Commando 713. This is how the story ends. I really don't know if this way it ends because I don't know what's going to happen next. But I'm going through the process and procedure to help others. That's the point and purpose of me doing this. I didn't like the negative comments you had for uh, Miss Sexy, uh, One Sexy Tina, nor Starlicious, nor quite a number of other places you have been. You routinely refer to women as bitches. I mean, really, just grow up. And, you know, just because I don't like the fact that you being negative and I say something about it, that don't make me a drama queen, nor does it make me uh, being negative. Just like you, I got to write the comment just like you. Just like you. That's not an exclusive thing for you. Well, my phone going off the chain. Uh, I guess I'm getting some more people on my uh, channel. Anyway, <clears throat> um, I'm going to type in here. Uh, the purpose of me reporting is to help others. That's what I'm all about. That's what I'm all about. I didn't really know what the procedure was or if it was even an option for people, but yes, there is. And YouTube, there's an option for people. So if you find yourself in a situation, people keep coming back with harassing comments, back and back and back. He's the only one. You can look on the, on, the, on the video where if it ain't already taken down, you go look on the video. It's about a handful of negative comments. You know, people said what they had to say, kept it moving, and it's on three dislikes. The video been view, viewed 6,500 times. I'm quite sure if people was hating that much, it'd be more dislikes. People just don't have time. But trolls, internet trolls, that's what they live for. They wait for a reaction. And this person is not going to <coughs> stop no matter what you do. He got to have the last word. And I saw that. Starlish is backed off. Kudos to you. Uh, sweetheart, you did, you handle your business tactfully, and you saw that he was one of them ones that keep coming back, so you just stopped with it. He kept it going. Sexy Tina, one sexy Tina, you didn't even give him no attention whatsoever. Also, I respect you. I, at first, I was getting annoyed because I was just meeting you, and like I said, I got personally attached in terms of, yeah, I like your channel and whatnot, and I ain't like the stuff he had to say directly to you personally about your physical attributes. I just thought it was out of line and uncalled for it. You trying to show everybody else, everybody else was enjoying your video about Red Riding Hood. It just was uncalled for. 
So now that's the end of the process. And baby, Commando 713, I ain't got no hate for nobody but cyber bullies and cyber trolls and internet trolls. I hate them. Trust and believe I got deep seated hate for y'all. Because you make it bad for everybody who trying to have fun, enjoy themselves on the internet, especially YouTube. That's all I got to say. Peace.